Welcome to Suwa. So we are in the Hengundong neighborhood. Um, I have taken you here so many times before and I'm not sorry for bringing you back. There's always something new here. Um, this is an area that if we were to ever move outside of Seoul, Kurt and I would strongly consider this area. You can get here from an express bus that's it's like 40 minutes from Gangnam. It's so easy to get here. Um, like I said, there's always something new opening. It's a ton of cafes and eateries. Um, and there's this like movement going on um, in Suwon to like make people excited about being from Suwon. <laughs> um, so there's like a lot of pride and like little local shops opening up, which is so cool. Um, so what we're actually gonna do today is just cafe hop because I've brought you to the palaces, I've brought you all around, and I just have a ton of cafes on my list and I want to get them done and I want to see them and I want to eat good pastries. So we're here, it's about noon, things are just opening, but as I like walked down this street heading to my first destination, I already found like a ton of other places I want to visit. So stress, I'm never done with Suwon. Um, but anyway, let us walk towards our first destination. Um, prepare for coffee. I had such a big breakfast to prepare myself for the amount of caffeine I'm gonna ingest today. <laughs> Hopefully I don't get really shaky, but um, the sacrifices we make. Okay, ready? Here we go. Just 
think that we could do it if we tried I think we can do it if we tried If only to say you're mine Sophia, you know that you and I Shouldn't feel like a crime I think we can do it if we tried SOS, I am so full of liquid. So originally the first place wasn't even on my map or on my list. It was just happened to be right next door and open early, so I went there. The lady was so nice. She gave me like extra stuff in there. <laughs> and I was like, oh, thank you, but also no thank you. We're going here later. So many cafes, so little tab. There's just like a real artistry, I don't know, in these cafes, like they're, so clearly just like individuals making something really special to them. I don't know, it's just like great. I love it. And that pistachio strawberry cream thing, what a dream, oh my God. Anyway, now we're walking a little bit south um, along the stream, underneath all of the willow trees uh, to our next cafe, which I think is recently open. I don't know about the food, I'm not gonna eat there. Um, but the architecture, like the interior design, um, seems really cool. So that's our next stop, Cafe Squared. <laughs> Next up, we are actually leaving Hengundong. I'm sorry, I lied. <laughs> um, but it's literally like a five minute bus ride, but I am walking by the palace. Um, I've already taken you guys there, so I'm not gonna go in today, but if you want to, um, check it out. It's a really interesting palace. It was very cool. Beware, there are like life-size figures of people hidden around. It scared the hell out of me. <gasps> that one literally made me scream. They are everywhere and like where you would least expect them. What the? Oh my God. Yeah, I'm literally surrounded. There's one right there too. Jesus. Get me out of here. Um, there are very old trees. Very old trees. There's a tree in there that tree, er, that tree, that's like 600 something years old. Anyway, I'm gonna find a bus and get another drink. And then I promise we're gonna get like some substantial food, okay? Shoes that belong to. 
In our neighborhood, what on earth is this? Okay, we're gonna investigate. Um, I'm going to get kimbap from this place. Let me get in the sun. I'm gonna get kimbap from this place that does a bunch of really interesting kimbaps. A lot of them are vegan. Um, but what the heck is this structure? This is so cool. Okay, hold on. <laughs> The map was wrong and it's not open today. It's doing like a soft opening. So, damn. But they have all these different kimbap, um, including one that is a tofu hummus kimbap, tempeh. Um, it looks really good. A hummus tempeh salad. Yeah. Okay, so it's just on the corner, but I guess we're not having it oh well that man in the really cool cafe was very nice to me but uh all right let's find something else this is cafe chuan which i've taken you to more than once so we're not gonna go but it is a glorious little tea cafe with a balcony that overlooks all of these willows seriously just like this road alone has like everything you could need but i need food <laughs> I was embarrassed and humbled by that Tom Yun. Um, I didn't realize that there was a Jungan mat. Like I just saw An Mayun and Mayun, and I was like, Mayun, I can do that. And she told me it was spicy, and I'm like, yeah, 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 because I love a spice. Like, I don't know if you guys know this, but I handle spice really well. Yo, that was like just pain. It was absolutely just pain. So anyway, I'm gonna go get like tea and maybe a scone 
to calm myself down. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> so stupid, dark on my love song, such a sudden wrong call. And book it all my gun, guess it's on red light. Sorry, I'm an anti romantic. Tada, I'm a simple jomori. home oh my god that Jomian took me out and then I had that nice latte and that really good cookie and I just sat in the warm Sun and I am gonna fall asleep on the bus back home um so <laughs> that was Suwon um, I actually just met two sisters who live here and who know my channel that was amazing thank you for saying hi I hope I did your neighborhood justice um it is just Oh, I mean that but also it's just like a really cool little place if you want to escape Seoul but still just like set yourself in one area and be able to walk around there's a palace there's all of these cafes um it's just like a really cute little getaway very easy to get to um especially if like this is your first trip outside of Seoul if you're a little nervous about traveling um so so easy so i'll um put some directions down below as always i have everything will be linked in the description box but um yeah i highly encourage you like if you're just a little nervous this is a really like first step outside of you know traveling in korea so okay i'm going to as i said get on my bus and fall asleep i'm reading a really weird book about superheroes which is so outside of my usual um so I'm feeling very like somebody's gonna pop out of the sky and like shoot me with lightning or something. I don't know. Um, that I swear to God that there was like just some, something in that drama. I'm so embarrassed, man. I should have just gotten the junk gun. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm going to head out. I'll also link my other Suwon vlogs because um, like I said, I'm here all the time. <laughs> I love it. Um, and so yeah, I thank you so much for joining me and uh, see you next time, okay?